my clients are entrepreneurs or small business owners and it's important to them to create a powerful business image, but they don't always have a huge budget to do it. So I have some great tips on how to get that graphic design, how to get that marketing without spending a ton. As far as graphic design, your logo and your business card are musts. And ways that you can get that done on a budget are um, using art, art students. So contacting the career services, uh, department at the Art Institute or at the local colleges, they can connect you with some of the best designers in their school. They'll put in a ton of time and a ton of energy and you'll get something great. For the business card, there are a lot of online print services that once you have that logo, you can just log in and they have free business card creation tools where you just upload the logo and it gives you different uh, setups. So Vista Print, Overnight Prints, any of those, you can just log in and upload your logo once you have it and create a business card very easily and inexpensively. Uh, another one is getting a website. Website is very important, but you can go buy it yourself. Um, there are a ton of places you can buy it, but one of the most obvious would be GoDaddy. You go there and type in your uh, whatever URL you're looking for. They'll tell you if it's ready and you can go ahead and reserve it for, I think it's 10 bucks a year. So it's a very inexpensive thing to go ahead and reserve that. You can also set up a holding page using one of their tools, which are often included when you buy the URL. Um, there's Instapage or there's Website Tonight, and that's something that it's created to be easy. It's created for people who aren't designers to be able to put something together. So for the 10 bucks for the URL and then maybe five bucks a month or it might be included in your purchase, you can set up a, a mini website that's operating for you. Um, another one would be getting a business address. So you want somewhere for all your, your business mail to go, somewhere to put on your uh, business cards to make you seem like a legitimate company. And you can set up a PO box. Um, there are a lot of them now because of the rise of small businesses and entrepreneurs that will let you set up an address and they'll accept mail to suite number you know, five or whatever it may be. So the address appears to be a business address even though it's really just a PO box. And the last one would be setting up a, a separate phone number. And there are a lot of options here. So you can buy you know, one of the throwaway cell phones and, and use that where you just buy minutes and update it and then have it forward to your phone or just get the messages there and use your regular phone. Um, you can also just use your cell phone, but make sure you change the message so it's your business. And you know, if you're gonna do that, you need to be comfortable with everyone you know calling you and knowing what your business is and understanding that that's where you are. But that can also be a great tool for showing the people in your life what you're doing and spreading the word about your business. So those are some ways to create a powerful business image without spending a ton of money.